Okay, hi guys, Good Black here. Today, I'm going to talk about who has. Oops, I'll take this off. Okay, so who has the like best 2L in the game? Or top 6 2L in the game? So, in case you don't know what that means, 2L is this crouching light. So, yeah, so I'm judging it based on range judging it on range speed and frame data so yeah yeah so so well before we get started I want to I want to thank the Doctor Blue for for discussing discussing this with me because um I watched his latest video which was called Who Has the Worst All Combo in the Game go check that out if you haven't watched it so and um and I discussed this topic with him. I didn't know about a way to go about it, you know, so I kinda spoke to him with it and he said yeah I should totally make a bit uh, totally go for it. So yeah, I just wanted to thank him for his su for his support. So yeah. So now that's out of the way, let's get started, so Number six. So we can go with Piccolo. You know, seven frame star up, you know, it's the same. I think that's standard for most characters. They usually their culture light is slower than their standing light. But because of that, it has more range. As you see here, yeah, it missed this that connected so yeah it's pretty standard mm, nothing I think it's one of the best ones I think out there Piccolo's yeah that's Piccolo's standard thing right here number five Samasu now Samasu's is a little different from Piccolo's because Samasu's as you can see I think it's crouching light. I think it has as much range, or maybe it doesn't. It's got exactly the same speed, exactly the same frame they are. So yeah, crouch. It's it's basically the same as Piccolo's. Nothing special about it really. It's because the standard light has so look much range the standard light has actually. Oh, it's actually pretty good. Yeah, some more seeds. Okay, number four. Android 21, look at this. Same speed as Piccolo's as all RCs, but the frame rate is a difference. It's minus two. Yeah, this is an excellent stagger tool. You just keep doing this. This standard light has some, it's not it's a big range, but yeah. As for the next characters, Yeah, these three think I think have 
probably be the best two hours in the game. And I'll explain once once the game is finished loading up. See, as you can see from there, 16 range is pretty good. Look at that. I mean, yeah, it's eight frames that's slower than usual, but you can't deny the range on this. It's the same thing with Broly, actually. I think Broly's is the same speed. It's exactly the same range, I think. The only difference is that Broly's doesn't... Z Broly's, anyway, not S Broly. I'll get to S Broly in a minute, but... I think that makes this one so good is the range. Look at this. And the frame data is pretty good as well. I'm gonna range on this. Yeah, so it has more range than a standard light, so that's pretty good. You can hear it twice as well. Yeah, so don't mind the colour. Oh, I should have changed the colour actually. It's colour sucks much. Oh well. But yeah, it's got a mad range. Good frame there. It's one frame slower than your average 2L, but you know, with something with that, with this much range, something with that much range, and and it's safe as well. Yeah. So yeah. Say top three. You could say Z Broly is up, is tied with him as well because it basically has the same range. The only difference is that it doesn't Z Broly's doesn't hit Z Broly's doesn't hit um crouches. It does not a low attack like 16s but I think the, the frame day on Z Broly's is minus two as well. So yeah. 16s. Next, number two. Now this one is tricky for me because I was deciding which two I was better, Jiren's or or Esperoli's, because because I was having a discussion with Doctor Blue and I was talking to him about the differences. About. Um, DBS Broly's 2L and Jiren's 2L. Uh, I'll bring it up to, sh to show you. So if you want distance. It's Broly's caption. 2L is unsafe on block. But it is 6 frame start. Which is the which I think is the fastest 2L in the game. Because most other characters 2L is 7 frames or 8 frames. Why is Broly's is 6? Unsafe, but look at the range on this. The range is more like a um, vertical range more than horizontal. It doesn't have as much range as, say, 16, but it pushes you forward. And it has very good vertical range, which is uh, I mentioned before. So let's bring in Jiren. This one's kind of difficult. It's pretty good range. 8 frames start up. It's the same speed as 16s. Minus 2 on block, which is really good. So this makes Jiren one of the best, has have one of the best dagger games in the game I think in my opinion because you could just keep doing this you can add frame traps as well in there yeah you could just keep doing that you won't be able to punish it because it's, it's lights in particular is what makes it status so good so yeah, and not only that actually, let me show you, good range, 8 frames are pretty, not very speed either, 
and also it has the skill, it skills, it's, it's a medium, skills like a medium starter, so it do, do a little combo. So yeah, that did 54.08, so let's do a medium starter. Yeah, that does more damage than a medium starter. It's actually that's actually pretty good, and it's faster than a standard medium as well, and it's better than it's just downright just better than a standard medium because Salomon does have good range. Not gonna lie, but you can see from the frame that his one is slower than his two L, and it is unsafe. Minus six means unsafe. Anything over minus five means unsafe. So it's faster. It's pretty good range. Hey, look at that. They both will hit from it, so both are good. The two L is just strictly better than his. So it's faster. It's fast. It's slower than S Broly's. It's got more horizontal range than Burley's, but Burley's has more vertical range. The biggest difference is that it is definitely it is safe on block. That's the biggest difference. So what would I say is better? Hmm. Both of their two worlds are really good. Both for different reasons as well. Like Burley's is good for it's it's sh the sheer speed of it because it is just as fast as the as a standard jab as for these yep, six frames and the height of it is really good because it means that jumping doesn't work with it as so soon as someone jumps you can just do that look how high it's up that means you can go into pressure and stuff How Jubens, so it's, it's I suppose it's good for that. Let's see, but with Jubens, if someone jumps, it's, it's, it's gonna whiff. If you, even if you're late, even if you're late with S Brody's, like, it's gonna always hit jumping opponents because of that, because that's how good its vertical range is. But, you really get the point. But after this long little back and forth with Juven and S Broly, I'm going to say top two is second place for best T1 in the game is S Broly. As much as I like for it to be the best, but it's really good. It's it's really good, but say the thing that holds it back is that it is unsafe on block. I mean, he sure makes up for it because let's say if they do press a button, because it is unsafe on block, you can't really stagger with it. But let's say if they do press a button, you can just do anything to that, which is a built-in frame trap. So that's fine. But because it is unsafe, I have to give the number one spot to Juren. Because Juren, it may not be as fast as um, things as um, S Broly's. Definitely makes up with it with its range. Its range is really good. Look at this. And in the latest patch, they made this move faster. Because before, it was 10 frames, and now it's 8. And then uh, before they buffed it, it was already a really good move. Probably one of the Germans. One of, if not his best normal. And now they made it even better. And it was all, and minus two, it was always minus two, I think. But uh, this patch made it better. 
don't like this color, I shouldn't have picked this color. <laughs> but I won't. Take what you can get, right? Um, yeah, so. So, yeah. I think, in my opinion, Jiren has the best 2 out in the game. Not because it hits low, because you can, you can see Android 18 is just standing up straight. She's not crouching or anything. Technically, the heat that Jiren's character that doesn't have any lows aside from his 2M. But, makes it good, it's not that it doesn't hit crouches because it doesn't hit crouches anyway so what makes it good is that it's minus two on block the range is really good and this instantly makes him one of the, one of the best staggers in this game because look you can just keep and you can always defend yourself because both of his lights are safe So yeah, and not only that, but also her skills like a medium star, even better, actually, even sk skills even better than that actually. Because he four, as the combo I showed before, it did more damage than this the combo that started with this. And that's usually not the case for most characters. Well, the Jiren gets to ignore the... He gets to ignore the Jiren ain't part of that rule though, because of this move, because of this. So yeah. So yeah, that's it. In my opinion, Jiren has the best crouching light or 2L in this game. So again, I want to give a special sh thanks to Dr. Boo for, ins for inspiring this video. Go check this um, go check his channel out and watch his latest video. He has the worst walk combo in the game. So yeah, uh, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. Like. Like the video if you enjoyed, dislike if you disliked it, and subscribe for more content. Okay, so yeah, so comment, so comment down below. Give me any ideas of any video you would like in the future. I dropped it below one. So. Yeah, so take care of yourselves guys, be nice and, you know, stay safe in these times, so, goodbye, yeah.